I'm here in Medjugorje next to the Viscas Farmer House, one of the visionaries, and I'm Vis. What's your name? My name is David. David, where are you from? I'm from Portland, Oregon. Portland, Oregon. And you said first time here? First time here. And you come with your wife? I came with my wife. And what's your name? Jill. Jill, Mary. you're also from Portland, yes. Oregon, yeah? Yes. Yeah, yeah. she's with me. Yeah. <laughs> yep. Wonderful. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And um, why did you come here? We were... Uh, on a pilgrimage to Mexico City mm -hmm. in January and one of the ladies that was on our pilgrimage to Mexico City was also coming here with this particular pilgrimage mm -hmm. and Jill felt called mm -hmm. and she felt the need to, for us to come and, mm -hmm. and so it's always been on our list it's been something that we've wanted to it's but our list is so long and it went from somewhere down here to up there. up there, yeah. And here you are. And here we you are. Ten days now. Mm -hmm. Ten days, uh -huh. yeah. Mm -hmm. Why were you attracted to come to Medjugorje? I want to feel more or closer to the Blessed Mother, and to me, this was the place I needed to come to. You felt it in the heart? Mm -hmm. Yep. Mm -hmm. And for you? Well, I, we're from a town mm -hmm. um, that's close to a church called St. Brigitta's in Portland. Mm -hmm. And in 1995, Mariana mm -hmm. came there uh, to talk, to give a talk, mm -hmm. and I went to that talk. Mm -hmm. And um, after that, I bought the Visions of the Children and mm -hmm. read it cover to cover. And it's always been one of those area, or one of those things. I just had to see it. You, know, you had to see. You want to come? Mm -hmm. Well, something I th I'm trying to think back at my mother, because mm -hmm. my mother died shortly before Mariana came to. Uh, St. Brigitta's okay. and I'm just trying to think if my if this was something that you remember if this was something that my mom had talked about I don't remember I don't but remember. I've always had a devotion ever since I was a little boy to the mm -hmm. Blessed Mother mm -hmm. and um, it just kind of confirmed it I mean we we're hitting is going to as many places where our mother has appeared mm -hmm. we've been to knock Mm -hmm. We've been to Mexico City, mm -hmm. and saw, viewed the Tilma, and now we're here. We hope to go to Lourdes, we hope to go to Fatima. Mm -hmm. We'll mm -hmm. see where she wants us to go. We'll go. And you, and you always have been Catholic? Yes, I'm cradle Catholic. For you too, always Catholic? Um, yes. No, not a, a lot of people say they left the faith, went into the world, and came mm, back. No. Wow, beautiful. No. You yeah. pray the rosary? Yes. yes. Why? How do you pray the rosary? To feel closer to Mary. Do you feel that when you pray? I do. I do. Do you feel peace? I feel a lot of peace. And prayers answered as well? Um. Not yet. No. Still pray, waiting pray, for pray, it. Pray, you know. Yeah. That's yeah. a hard question. Yes. Because maybe they're being answered and I'm just not aware of it. Mm -hmm. yeah. And for you, the rosary prayer? Oh, yes. A uh, lot of peace in the rosary. Lot a lot of peace. Oh, yeah. So it's more connected to Jesus through Mary yeah. with the rosary. That's for our Protestant friend to always yeah. ask by Mary, no? Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. So I mean, she Jesus. leads us yeah. to right to him. All of the mysteries of the rosary mm -hmm. are directing us and right where I, I haven't read all her messages here, mm -hmm. but she says, go to my son, go to my son, go to my son. Mm -hmm. And the rosary takes you to her son. Mm -hmm. And... Um, you seem convinced Catholics. Why? Why are you are convinced Catholic? What truth. is the beauty about the faith? It's yeah. the truth. Mm -hmm. It's the truth. It's all contained mm -hmm. when the Father says, "Take this and eat it." Mm -hmm. the host. This is yeah, the host. It's that's no longer the host. It's the Eucharist. It's mm -hmm. that is Jesus there in mm -hmm. the form of the bread and the wine. Mm -hmm. And when you go to Holy Mass, when you, you take the Eucharist, what is the effect for you? Oh, it's Life-giving. Life-giving. It's life-giving. Yeah. It's in. It's right, right there. Yeah. And for you? Very calm. Right here, too. Just calm. It's just calm. Yeah. And if you can make a little promotion for your faith, you are also convinced Catholic. I see it. You yes. You know, why, why Catholic? Um, it's, the only, it's the only way I know. Mm -hmm. It's the only thing I believe. Mm -hmm. And um, I just feel a very calm presence when I'm in church. I can have the worst day in the world, attend church, and it's all better. Mm -hmm. And you know, here in Medjugorje, the, um, the confession is the central point. What would you tell people? I think you go to confession, right? 
Mm-hmm. Why would why what would you tell people um, why it's so beautiful and if there's somebody now listening inspired want to go but is scared after 20 years to go what will the priest think of me what would you tell him? Um, they're happy to see you. Once you go, you feel immediately weights mm. and weights and weights lifted off of your soul, your being. You feel calm, you feel better, you just feel light. You you can continue on. Mm. Doesn't mean that you're not going to Sin again, slip up sin and, and have fun. to go back again, but uh-huh. taking that first step is, is big. Mm-hmm. And once you do that first step, hopefully it'll be easier. Yeah. And for you, confession, what is the beauty and what would you tell these people? It's the mercy of Jesus. Mm-hmm. It's, it's his, that's his gift to us mm-hmm. to give us not only the Eucharist, the Eucharist feeds us, confession frees us. Mm-hmm. And, you know, we, uh, whether you're, have been, you go monthly, mm-hmm. weekly, mm-hmm. yearly, mm-hmm. and it mat- that matters not to me. Mm-hmm. I, if I don't go for a month, I feel the same when I leave if I've gone every week. Mm-hmm. It's a relief. It's a, it's a, it's a, it's a lifting. It's a load off your shoulders. Ma- yeah. main, same impression I yeah. have, or same effect. And, um, you know, there are a lot of people out there, they think God the Father is an old man with a white beard and angry. <laughs> but he's not. What is God the no, Father? Can you describe him? No, a he's God the Father is, is God the Holy Spirit, is God the Son. Mm-hmm. He is forgiving. He is loving. He loves you. If you think Mary loves you... Mm-hmm. Wait for God the Father. Wait for God the Father. Yeah, yeah. wait experience for God the Father. That. Yeah, experience that. Cause mm-hmm. she, she is leading you to it. She's showing you, giving you a glimpse of what God the Father can give you or will give you when you meet him in eternity. She's not doing that. She's just giving people here the opportunity to see that. The visionaries have seen that. They've mm-hmm. seen the, a, glimpse of, a glimpse of heaven. Mm-hmm. Uh, the three children, the shepherd children in Fatima, they've seen it. Mm-hmm. You know, she's not doing it. That's God the Father. Yeah. And that's Paradise. very important to say people, I think, forget this sometimes. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And for you, God the Father? Say, I can't say it any better than uh, That was said. beautiful, you yeah. know? Yeah. 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 And what did Jesus do in your life? How did he change your life? Um, well, he introduced me to him. <laughs> <laughs> your husband? <laughs> wow. You what is in the, the right 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 Look at yeah, yeah. And they're shining. Yeah, yeah, they're yeah, shining. Yeah, yeah. And you know, you're married. A lot of people here, they look for vocation. How do you find the right partner? And how? what is the secret of a good marriage for you guys? Well, for me, communication, mm-hmm. you know, we talk, we yeah. pray. We love each other. Mm-hmm. We accept each other. Forgive she accepts. Other. She accepts my faults and forgives me mm-hmm. more than I deserve. Mm-hmm. Uh, yes, we uh, Well, let's There'd be honest. Be let's be honest. You know, you know they have this extra sense, no? <laughs> yeah, 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 it's written in yeah, the yeah, Bible. Yeah. Yeah. And besides, she's beautiful. I mean, she's yeah, beautiful. Out, she's beautiful outside and inside. Yes. Mm-hmm. She's one of the most giving persons I've ever met. Mm-hmm. She'll give of herself until she falls over. And. Um, Beautiful. And how, how did you meet? Did you pray for a good wife? Or how did that happen? Chance meeting. God incident? Yeah, it's, it's one of those lightning bolts. Yeah. And yeah. Yes, it was immediate. Mm-hmm. I knew immediately. You, you knew it immediately. immediately. Mm-hmm. That's I right. knew. That's her. That's the one. Well, that's the can, one. You give me goosebumps. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's and the one. And for you? Same. Same. Um, yeah, immediately. We connected right away. Yep. This is amazing. Wow. And. Um, what will you tell people? Why should they come? What time to make you There, there's something here. It's a for a lot of people, at least from the Americas, it's a long journey. Mm-hmm. And exactly. and then if you if you decide to come here, it's not your decision to come here. You've been called. Mm-hmm. And there's something here. Uh, I don't. I can't put my finger on. It. I can't describe it. But there's it, there's something. Mm-hmm. There's something about this area. Mm-hmm. Uh, way, the Way of the Cross, Apparition Hill, the church, the evening programs, the adoration, mm-hmm. the lines. P- the people in America, at least in where our part of America, mm-hmm. uh, in the United States, if they saw the lines for confession here, they would, it would blow their mind. They would think that you're making it up. And we go back and tell them, tell our friends and tell people that... Mm-hmm. Uh, there's 200 people under a canopy waiting to go into the confessional and it just keeps building and building and that's not just like a one and done it is that for three hours 
they, they, it's unbelievable. Yeah, unbelievable. There's, a, there's a lot of hope here. Yeah. Mm -hmm. There's a lot of hope here because yeah. when you look, you would think that, you know, oh, this is for, you know, bald men, gray hairs, <laughs> old ladies, you know, like ring, you, know. <laughs> you, know, you know, praying their rosaries yeah. because they're, they're coming Not for close. Beautiful ladies yeah, <laughs> coming, coming close to the grave. Yeah. But there's so many young people, yes. young families, the future. the future of the church. Uh, the future, I mean, just shows, I mean, the, the call is there. You yeah. just have to open your ears and your heart. And you will, dis that's also the, the mm. next question, how to reach your vocation. Yeah. You have to just yeah. open up. No? Yeah. You have to open up your heart, be ready for it. Uh -huh. And um, the, the thing that I like about what I would love is to have this type of uh, town in the United States. It may be there. I'm just not aware of it. Mm -hmm. But everyone is friendly. Everyone is faith-based, everyone we've met at least. Very mm -hmm. friendly, very faith-based. We've even joked that the dogs are even friendly, the yes. dogs that are <laughs> roaming the street. They're even friendly, and they're, and they're everywhere. They're by mm -hmm. the church, and they come up to you. I mean, it's just, it's just a great little town. Mm -hmm. We have not had a negative experience mm -hmm. here in the last, you know, time since, since ten, we've been Ten days here. we've yeah. been here. Same with me. Not, yeah. not even filming in the yeah. streets people yeah. are kind yeah. they're smiling yeah. at me you yeah know? we were we were with a group of people and before we came this like we said this is our first time mm -hmm. and we came with some people who you know we meet before mm -hmm. we get on the plane to come here mm -hmm. and they you know some people how many times have you been two how many times have you been three how many mm -hmm. times five how many times five four and we're looking at each other before we come here and going, why in the heck would anybody go there three four five times yeah. I understand now I, I understand. I mean, I thought that you mm -hmm. could come here and rent some place for a month, six weeks, mm -hmm. and really immerse. Really uh, but I can see mm -hmm. the why Mary's call is so strong, mm -hmm. and that I mean, there's like I said, there's something here. It, there's something I don't you can't, you can't you can't describe it. Can it's hard to describe. Yeah. It's but it's a feel. And you know, once you feel it, mm -hmm. I think you want it more, mm -hmm. so, and that's why the some of our fellow programs have been here four, five, six times. Mm -hmm. yeah. You know, I, I, mean, I interviewed a guy 150 times. Oh my goodness! From France. I understand. Yeah. I understand, yeah. I understand yeah. why. Easier from France than the United States because that <laughs> that that twelve hour plane flight from Sarajevo or Istanbul is that's a that's a long yeah, flight. I mean, it yeah. is. It's just, that's already a sacrifice yeah. to come here. Yeah. yeah. Just yeah. offer it up. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Thank you so much yeah. for that Thank beautiful you. interview. Yes. Thank you. Thank you.